Hello researchers, how are you? I hope you are fine and doing well. In this video, I am going to demonstrate you the step-by-step -step installation of React operating system. I can say a perfect free operating system, a good alternative to Microsoft Windows on Oracle VirtualBox. Now before we proceed with the installation part, the download part and its basic awareness regarding the GUI and present whereabouts, let us first of all know why React operating system was launched in the market, what was its history and something regarding its features. Microsoft Windows is regarded as the big dominance in desktop PC operating system for almost 30 years from now. Thank God for various options like operating system X from Apple and Linux from Linus Torvalds but has been choking the Redmond company. But believe me everyone that still in terms of operating system, in terms of desktops, laptops, Microsoft Windows is having a huge share. But the share is you can say right now fluctuating by different operating systems when they are coming. The main operating system which I would like to demonstrate you today in this video is React operating system. Yes, everyone, you listen me right. A new operating system, a new alternative for Windows by Microsoft. If we talk of the brief about the history of React operating system, it is about around 1996, a group of free and open source software developers started a project called Free Win 95 to implement a clone of Windows 95. The project stalled in discussion of the design of the system, but while Free Win 95 has started out high expectations, but there has not been builds by the public since the end of 1997. The project members led by the coordinator Jason Philby joined together to review the project. The project began development in February 1998 by creating the basis for the new anti-kernel and basic drivers. Why the React operating system was there so that the React referred to the group dissatisfaction and reaction to Microsoft monopolistic position. Now if we talk of React operating system, what is this all about? React is an open source operating system for x86 and x64 PC intended to be binary compatible with computer programs and device drivers made for Windows Server 2003. Development started in 1996 as a clone for Windows 95 and which was in 1998 it was continued as React operating system. The main alternative is to provide to allow you to remove Windows and install React operating system without end user noticing the change. Now, as of February 2016, React operating system is considered as alpha software and therefore recommended by developers only for evaluation and testing purposes. If we talk of what is behind its development, it is primarily written in C with some elements such as React OS File Explorer written in C++ and the project partially implements Windows API functionality and has been ported to the ARM and AMD64 processor architectures. React operating system as part of FOSS ecosystem reuses and collaborates with many other FOSS projects and most notably the Vine project which develops a Windows compatibility layer for Unix-like operating systems. The initial release was in 1998 about 18 years ago and the latest release is 0.4.0 which was done in February 16, 2016 about 12 days back. So, in this video, I am going to demonstrate you how to install. Now, as you can see on my screen, I have already opened React Operating System website. You can see the React Operating System 0.4.0 and even if we are just alpha. And if we talk of the features, it is having lightweight. It only requires 500 MB of hard disk drive and 96 MB of RAM, which means that if I give 512 MB of RAM or 1 GB RAM to this PC, it will run very, very beautifully and it is has been written from scratch it is not linux making windows it is about having more than 9 crore plus lines of code and it is growing 100 plus developers styles tons of open modules ready to install and even you can try with the use of the live cd so you can see this website and lots and lots of latest news and latest blogs over there so if you can click on this link called download now, there are two options which are being available. So the first is called the boot CD and second is called the live CD. Now, if you go over the live CD, you can just, uh, you can say open this live CD and you can just have some experience. You will not able to install this live operating system or uh, you, you can, you will not be able to install the live operating system on your VMware VirtualBox. So what I recommend is to go with the boot CD. 
So Boot CD will be able to allow you to install React operating system on your PC. So even if it is having Kemo preloaded, VMware preloaded and VirtualBox preloaded. So you can see it's going to have a good blast. So if you can click on this gallery, you can find lots and lots of uh, softwares which are being ready. So you can see Themes, LibreOffice, Explorer, SimCity, WinRAR. So you can say almost, you can find that almost every uh, main uh, software which is available for Windows, it is available for React operating system. You can even click on forum, you can even contribute, you can provide some bugs over there. Everything is basics over there. So now you can see on my desktop, I have already downloaded this React operating system. If I right click over here and click on properties, it is not a big operating system, it is about a 93 MB, even less than 100 MB of operating system. So if you're having a decent broadband connection, you can just download in matter of four to five minutes or even one to two minutes in case of a good broadband speed. So if you double click this RAR file, you can find this is a ISO and the latest version is 0 .0, uh, 4.0 so we are using we are going to use this so i've already extracted this ISO image on my desktop and if i right click it so it is about 113 mb so we are going to use this image into our oracle virtual box so i open oracle virtual box now you can see i click on new and i go with react operating system so over here what you have to do is to just go and click on windows 95 so click on next. So what I have to provide is to provide it about 512 MB of RAM, which is good enough. So click on next and click on about a two GB hard disk drive would be enough for it. So I just recommend to give it uh, two GB. So even you can provide it 100 MB or even 500 MB. So you, it is all depending on you. So just click on create. So click on next. So dynamically allocated and I just give it two GB of space. So click on create. So now let us power on this machine. So it will be running with the ISO image. So let us browse this ISO image from my desktop. So click on desktop and here's the React operating system. So click start. So let's see its opening output. So a blue screen has come. So let's wait. Yes. So now you can see that React operating system setup has started and the first screen has given me language setup. So I will be just taking English United States. So press enter. And now you have to see the welcome screen that is uh, welcome to React operating system. So press enter to install, press R to repair, press L to have React operating licensing terms and F3 to quit. So you can say that it is almost having Windows XP or Windows 95 like installation screens. So I have to install React operating system in my video. So I press enter. So now you can see that React operating system is showing, it is showing that it is under early development and it does not have yet full support of all the functions. So the limitations are setup supports FAT file system and file system checks are not implemented yet. So I just skip it. So I just press enter to continue. So the list below shows the current device setting. It has detected my computer, my display, my keyboard and the keyboard layout. So I accept all these changes by pressing enter again. So now you can see that it is giving us the partitioning of the screen. So what I have to do, I just have to create a primary partition. So I just press P and I just press enter. So now the primary partition has been uh, created. You can even create extended partitions or uh, you can say other logical partitions, but I just need a single partition. So press enter to install. So now you are finding two or uh, two file system that is called fat file system, quick format and file system. So it will not support NTFS till date. So only fat will be there. So just I press on the quick format and press enter and press enter again to start the format. So now you can find that it has given us the installation path. So press enter again. So now it is installing. So it will not take much time. So this is an important step. Setup is installing the bootloader. So install bootloader on hard disk drive. So without taking any other option, just press enter. And now we will just be putting up enter to reboot the computer. So I will not press any key to boot from the CD. It will be booting from the hard disk drive. 
So now you can see that the React operating system has been come. So it is having different options like React operating system, debug, ROS debug, screen, log file, RAM disk, emergency management services. So I will just be taking the first option and press enter. So now you can see that the graphical interface has come and it is installing the devices. Now the setup wizard will guide you through the rest of the process for the React operating system setup wizard. So just press next. And now you have to be clicking on the acknowledgement screen so that the operating system is licensed under the GPL and you read the documentation right here. So just press next. So if you want to change any user setting or keyboard layout, you can change it. So otherwise press next. And now I just write my name, Anand Nair, and I write any organization like ABC Software Limited. You can write any name. So press next. And now I just write the computer name as react os and administrator password let me give my strong password so it is having good capabilities so press next so now let me change the time to india so now you can see it's having very fluffy interface so press next and now it is just installing the operating system But React operating system is built from scratch, but it still relies on some dependencies from open source projects like Wine, Mesa 3D for graphics, Haiku for USB support. So it will uh, reboot. So don't press the key and I press enter again. And very nice operating system. So now you can see that uh, uh, the device has already been installed. So I just press next and press enter. So now you can find that it is having a clean Windows like interface. So same programs, accessories, administrative tools, games. If I click on this solitaire, same game like that I used to play. And uh, you can find uh, startup React Operating System Applications Manager. Same like we have add and move programs in Windows. You can just press over here and you can download anything. So just you need a internet connection. So you can just click on Winamp. You can press enter for games. We are having different games like that. You can install anything. It is having Linux based repository where you can add the application packages, etc. So if I double click on computer, you can find the C drive, same operating system like this. So very good clean interface. If I click on properties, you can even browse for uh, desktop like this. So click on apply and very good uniform operating system. So click on properties. Let me go with the settings part with the increase of resolution. So I click apply. Now you can see that the operating system is there. So command prompt is again there. So you can give command like date, time, dir slash w. So cd react operating system, dir slash w. So all interface like that. So in this video, I have demonstrated you how to install React operating system. You can find that it is having a clean Windows like interface. So do download it, do give it a shot and do do some very good work as compared to your normal Windows operating system. It's a good alternative, everyone believe me. So do give a like to this video if you like this. Thank you so much.